guys, so this morning I'm going to show you how to make a bowl of microwavable porridge. So here in my bowl I have added one sachet of these microwavable porridge oats that I got in Aldi. I'll just show you the packet. So the packet comes like this and there's about 30 grams in the packet. So then it says to add 160 mils of milk. Now you can pour out 160 mils of milk here. That's uh, about 160 mils. And pour it straight into your bowl over your porridge oats. Now, if you don't want to be measuring out your milk every morning, what you can see here is that the milk has just kind of come up to cover the oats, hasn't it? So enough milk to cover the oats will do. And it comes up about a quarter of a way on, on my big spoon. Okay? Let me just show you that now with a clean spoon. So if I dip the spoon in, I can see that the milk has come up just there about a third of the way on the spoon, hasn't it? So I'm going to give that a little bit of a stir down my spoon. And then here around the box, we can see. Can you see it here? It tells you what wattage. So on your microwave, your microwave might have a wattage. Let's check and see my microwave. So my microwave has a wattage of 800 watts. So here it tells us that if your microwave is 750 watts, you should leave it for three minutes. If your microwave is 850 watts, you should leave it for two and a half minutes. And if your microwave is 900 watts, you should leave it for two minutes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it for two minutes. I'm going to give it a stir and see how we get on. Okay. So will you come back in two minutes? So actually, I'm going to show you how to turn it on. Now, every microwave is different. Some of you might just have to press the button to bring it up 30, 30, 30, 30. But with my one, I can just turn it up along to two. Okay, and that's two minutes. So off it is in the microwave. So my microwave is coming to a finish now. It's just about to ping. There we go. So let's open it up and check. Now the bowl might be hot, so you just have to be careful. So that looks good, but I think I'm going to put it in for another little minute. Just so some more of that milk can soak up. So I'm going to pop it back in for another minute. Be careful now if mommy and dad might need to help you if the bowl is hot, okay? So I'm going to pop it back on for another minute. Okay, nearly there. It's just about to ping again. There we go. So this time I'm going to go and I'm going to get a tea towel to take it out because it might be a little bit hotter this time. I'm going to wrap the tea towel around it and take the bowl at the top. So now that looks much more cooked, doesn't it? The milk is after soaking up. I'm going to give it a stir and the next thing I'm going to do now is add my toppings. So my toppings are going to be banana and peanut butter and honey. So I'm going to take this, I'm going to get a spoon from my drawer, I'm going to get myself a teaspoon. Here's my teaspoon, I'm going to put in one teaspoon of peanut butter. Just here. Just like that. And then I'm going to put my banana on top. Just there on the side. Pop in all that banana there. And then I'm going to get my honey. I'm going to give it a good squirt all around. That's about a teaspoon of honey as well. And there you have it. Voila! Your first bowl of my...